right, time for the big reveal. Let's live it. Make sure you guys are subscribed by clicking the link down below. Do you think we should jump in the pool and go swimming? <laughs> I'm thinking I want to go swimming today, but I'm also thinking Brian is going to make us a delicious lunch, so I'm so excited for that. It is such a beautiful day today, and since the boys are out of school, I'm going to be doing some grilling poolside while they do some swimming. This video was sponsored by the National Pork Board, and a huge thanks to them because I have got a craving for some pork chops. For those of you who don't know, the National Pork Board is focused on building a bright future for the pork industry through research, promotion, and education. Did you know that a lot of people actually think you have to cook pork until it's all wiped all the way through with clear juices? This is actually false and will result in overcooked pork and no one wants to eat overcooked meat. So I'm gonna show you guys today how to cook pork perfectly. Today I am grilling up some amazing looking pork loin pork chops and I've seasoned them the same way I would a steak. Just some salt and pepper, seasoning, salt, garlic, etc. And I've even got my handy dandy Weber eye grill too to make sure I get the perfect temp. All right you guys, let's get these pork chops on the grill. I am gonna get them started at medium heat probably for about four minutes on each side. Cuts like this, your loin roast, your pork chops, your tenderloin, should all be cooked to an internal temperature of 145 degrees, followed by a three minute rest. This is super important to make sure that your pork gets cooked perfectly and safe. Pork is really quick and easy to cook when done properly, and it's also very versatile. You can marinate it, you can season it, and it's packed full of nutrients. So these pork chops have been grilling for about four minutes on this side, so I'm gonna flip them and get them started on this side. Oh, and they look so good, you guys. Check that out. I love a good grill char. We are also gonna get our Weber Eye Grill 2 hooked up. I'm gonna put that in the pork and we're gonna make sure we get the perfect temp. So I've got my Eye Grill probe and I'm gonna put it in right. All right, I've got my pork chops situated. I'm now going to shut the grill for about two minutes and get those things cooking. What I love about pork, you guys, is that it's packed with nutrients. Just three ounces of pork has 23 grams of protein, which these boys need to build strong muscles. All right, pork chops are finished. I'm taking them off the grill and taking them inside. Yummy. Now that the pork chops have rested for three minutes, it's time to eat. You want to see a warm blush pink center in this pork. It's the safest, it's the yummiest way to eat pork. All right, let's try this out. I'm so excited. Perfect. That is some perfect pork, you guys. Yum. So go buy some pork, you guys, and be sure to check out pork.org slash grilling for more grilling tips and recipe inspirations. Huge thanks to National Pork Board for sponsoring this video. Now it's time to eat. Yum. Lunch was so good, and now we are headed in for a haircut, but Finn fell asleep. I think he had too much fun today. He fell asleep preemptively. Normally, the kids fall asleep during the haircut, right, Ollie? Yeah, do you guys remember that? That was so funny. I fell asleep. Let's link it up in the iCard. He fell asleep during haircut. It's the cutest thing you'll ever watch. Show us, boys. Hair. Yeah. I love your hair. Do you like Ooh, it, Ollie? Like that. Yeah. Ooh. Looks so good. We went really short, um, but they are always so good during haircuts. They love getting their haircuts, so I think it's really fun. We are home now, and the boys thought it'd be fun to pull out a little project. A few weeks ago, our friends Carl and Ginger were here. She had this great idea to make ice cubes, like colored ice cubes and put little surprises in them, huh? They are frozen. How long did it take to freeze? You need to like spend the whole time and then you have to check on them 
every day and if one of freeze, you can take them out. Awesome, yeah. So he kept checking on me. He's like, they're not done yet. I think they only took about 12 hours to freeze, but he thought they took like two weeks. <laughs> okay, the boys have each picked their um, poop icicles. All right, let's go ahead and see what surprises are inside. Ready? Okay. And go. <gasps> oh my goodness, what did you get? Wow! Oh, then smashing his open. Woo! Did I'm you get it? Mom. Yeah, let me yeah, see. Look at that surprise. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, goodness. Thank you, Carl and Ginger, for this awesome idea. <laughs> Ollie, your hair looks so good, dude. Do you like it? Mm -hmm. I always get so nervous before I do his hair because I kind of love his hair when it's like long and like cool. But you know, he kind of needed like a shorter cut, especially because it grows so fast and it's so hard to like go and keep up with it so constantly. But I want to know what you guys think up in the iCard vote. Do you like Ollie's hair long? Or short. Cause I was thinking, like, wouldn't it be fun one day to like grow it out really long? Maybe make it like a little man bun. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments what you think. If we should grow it out long or if we should keep it short. I think he looks cute no matter what, though. They're both so cute. Finn, let me see your haircut too. You look adorable. It's crazy how different their hair is. His hair is like very wispy, um, wiry, and like curly. And yours is very like fine and silky and straight. Oh my goodness, it's your happy birthday month, huh? It's Almost. Halloween time. It's Halloween time? Yeah. And you're talking so good. We should decorate oh the house. A we little should bit. start decorating, huh? That would be so fun. Yeah, we are so excited for Halloween. You guys, I can't believe it is basically October. I am so excited to get candy. Yeah. I think this video is going to be just before October, but it is basically Halloween time, which is, I kind of think this kid's favorite holiday. Do you think Halloween's your favorite holiday? Yeah. Yes? Even so more than guys, Christmas? I like Christmas and Halloween. Oh, I think it's a really big toss up. Let me know down in the comments though, what is your favorite holiday? I think mine's Christmas, but I think yours is Halloween because you get so excited, huh? Yeah, I'm excited. I like getting candy. You do like getting candy, huh? Woo! Ollie, where are you? Ollie, there you are! <laughs> we had such a fun day today, huh? Yeah. You got a cute haircut. I love it. And you have school tomorrow, so you're gonna have so much fun. I'm gonna Picture have this. so much fun because I'm gonna have a party. It is, there's a party at school, my, huh? My He's apple like, yeah. It's my apple day. It's your happy birthday. It is your happy birthday month. Yeah. Woo! We're still talking about the same thing. Hey guys, give this video a huge thumbs up if you love their haircuts and if you love getting haircuts. Fresh dudes my, always my, feel good. My. Hey guys, my favorite thing about the haircuts is when they cut this. Mm -hmm. I like it how you, how when you feel it, it's like so spiky. Yes, he loves this. He loves it when he gets a haircut and you can feel it. Isn't that so cute? As you can hear from this guy, it's definitely bedtime. All right, so I just got kids to bed, and like I said, tomorrow is actually picture day, and I thought it would be really fun to actually include that footage in this video. So let's go ahead and fast forward to tomorrow. Picture day, boys! Finn chose Fruit Loops, but then changed his mind to Chocolate Pebble cereal. And I was like, I don't feel like fighting with you, so there you go. Boys are eating some breakfast, and I'm gonna go ahead and pick out some cute outfits for Picture Day. Sound good? Yeah. All right, I'm looking through their shirts, just trying to find something that I think would be cute. I don't really wanna do like tank tops. Don't really wanna do like a dark shirt because I want it to like kinda be bright and, and fun. And I want the neckline to be like cute. Cute. What do you guys think? What color shirt do you think I should go with for this? these uh, back to school pictures? You know what? I am loving this. I love the fact that it's bright, it's not too dark, it's super cute. I like the collar. I'll have to make sure it looks nice. All right, what do you guys think? I think this is an awesome little outfit. So they've got some gray skinny jeans and this cute plaid blue gray shirt. I totally think it fits their personality. It's a little bit dressier than they would normally wear, but I think it's perfect for picture day. Let me know down in the comments though if you think they're gonna look so cute in this. Let's go ahead and get them dressed.
Da -da -da -da. Look at these yeah. cute boys! You guys look so cute for picture day. Ollie's haircut turned out so cute and it looks so handsome. Your shirt looks good. Pants, let me see yours, Finn. Look at your cute haircut too. You guys look like twins. You guys, I think they look so cute. Thumbs up if you think they look adorable. Yay. For school picture day, we gotta hurry to school, huh? Yeah! And today is kind of a party day for you, huh? Yeah. Awesome, high five. This kid is gonna mess up everything because he's playing right now. and I thought it was so cool that I actually got to see them do their sibling photos. They actually still have to do their individual ones, which I didn't get to stay for, but they were so cute and they were doing so good and I just loved it. I'm so excited to see their school photos, which we should hopefully see in a few weeks. I thought it'd be fun to go follow me on Instagram and I'm going to post an old school photo of myself when I was maybe their age, a little bit younger. So be sure to follow me on Instagram so you can go see it. And I thought it'd be cool if you guys posted some school photos of yourself and I will comment on some of them if you tag me. But anyways, we're gonna go ahead and end this video. The boys look so cute. Make sure you give it a huge thumbs up if you thought the boys looked adorable today. But we'll see you guys in our next video. Bye!